Hi, everybody. We recently put out a poll asking you what was hindering you from your job search. And one of the top answers was, I don't know where to begin. And I think what that really means is I don't even know where to start searching for a job, right? So assuming that you have a good search strategy in place, you've been listening along for the last few weeks as we've been talking a lot about that, um, you have a good resume put in place, you're, you're confident in your LinkedIn profile and your social media interaction, things like that, it's now time to start really thinking about where you look for your next opportunity. There are lots of great websites out there to start doing your searching. Um, and, and I think that's important to keep an eye on the job boards, Indeed, Career Builder, all of those, the ladders, if you're a 100,000 100, plus employee, that's a great um, place to start looking. Of course, LinkedIn Jobs is one of the big ones right now as well. So start looking at those sites. We're gonna publish a list this week of all of the um, all of the sites that you should take a look at to consider. So you have a full inventory. So be watching our blog for that. But also start thinking about your network. You know, we often refer to them as hidden jobs. You'll hear them called that sometimes. But those jobs that magically seem to get filled by someone and you didn't even know that they were available. You didn't even know that the company was searching, right? And how did suddenly that happen? It happened because somebody had a great network that helped them identify a great candidate or helped a great candidate identify a great employer, all sort of on the down low. So be thinking about how to use your network as part of your job search. It should really be a key part of your strategy. With over 85%, according to LinkedIn, over 85% of people find their next job for, through someone they know or through their network. So when that's the case, Start thinking about where you devote your time. Yes, you need to apply online. Yes, you need to follow the proper protocol when a company asks you to submit their, your resume that way. But you also need to be devoting a lot of time to your network and building that network. And that network isn't just asking, what can you do for me? Hopefully it's something you've been building along the way. So you have been building some capital within your network so that now that it is time, for you to quietly share, hey, this is going on in my life and I need to make a change, you can really rely on those people in your network to help you moving forward. So give some thought to that this week. You know, who are who's in your network that can help and how can they help you identify those, those opportunities that maybe aren't even being talked about in public? If you need help building that search strategy, that networking strategy, check out the free courses on our website or reach out to us. We're happy to help you. Take care. Bye-bye.